Hello everyone, welcome to today's video. So today we're going to see a lot of premium collections for Diwali. So we are at the Jubilee store on the first floor. So here we have a lot of collections, different varieties, different crafts. So to get more details on these sarees, please contact on the numbers below or you can visit the website and you can visit both of our branches. So let's get started. <music> Before going to the first section, we are at the display of the Jubilee store in the first floor and you can see there are a lot of sarees that are displayed here. And here is one of my favorite crafts which is like a patola sari. So this one is a completely woven patola and it's very unique. So let's actually move on to the section where we have the most premium collections. Here is the premium collection. So this one is having a different variety of crafts. So we have a lot of Pythonese behind me, Kalamkaris, Bandhanis, Zarikotas, Patolas sparsy work embroideries so all varieties so out of this I'm going to pick out what are my certain favorite collections here so the first sari that I'm showing you is like a Kalamkari sari so this one is a completely hand painted Kalamkari sari so you can see there's a lot of detailing on the sari and there's also this beautiful kanjiwaram contrast border to it and there's a lot of detailing which is up completely like a hand painted natural color sari so again here we behind me there are a lot of pythonies both in tissues and just a plain borders too. So here again I'm going to pick out something that's everybody's favorite which is like an all over pythony border along with a body. So this one has the simple booties in it in the body and it has a minimal border towards the top. And towards the bottom we have a very heavy floral detailing in it throughout completely. So this one will be a perfect option for your Diwali. If you're somebody who's looking for something that is rich heritage sari, then this is a perfect option. Then moving on to in this section, we have a lot of Zari Kotas. Uh, so I'm blindly picking out one because everything is packed up here. So here we are taking out this one, which is a purple color sari. So this one has complete detailing. Oh, this is so pretty. So in the body, you can see there's a lot of Meenakari detailing, a lot of flowers, a very beautiful multicolor range. So purple is a beautiful color. So as you can see in the body, we have these birds detailing, which are very minimal. And uh, towards the borders, we have simple borders. So for this sari, we have given you a blouse, which is like a polka dotted blouse. So you can see it has simple polka dots along with the border. So moving on, we are going to a different section and uh, here we are going to see a lot of Kanjiwarams and Banarsis. Uh, so like I told you just before, we are going to look at a lot of tissue Kanjiwarams, Kanjiwarams and a lot of Banarsi saris. So here we have this lovely tissues behind me. So if you are a new bride or if you are going to be a bride for this Diwali or you want to wear something heavy, then we have a lot of tissue collections. I am actually confused as to what should I take out because all of these saris are beautiful. But here I am picking out something that is actually which caught my eye which is like a lavender color sari. So this one in the body has this lovely color detailing in a lot of pink, lavender and all of that. You can see it's very intricate yet very soft. When I touch it, it's really smooth and silky. So but we have this plain borders to it. So if you're a person who loves this plain khaddi border uh, kanchi saris, then this is a perfect option. Then moving on to behind me, you can see this premium range of kanji varams. So these all are in different colors. So we have covered all the light, dark and all of these colors. But out of this, again, I'm picking up something that's like my favorite, which is like a pastel blue. So this one is also like a traditional piece. So this has this beautiful detailing in it, a very vintage style Kanjiwaram sari. So in the base you have a tissue detailing for this one, which is very minimal. And on top of it, you can see this traditional style elephant motifs along with the border, which has a lot of peacock detailing and with a lot of detailing in it. And then again, moving on to this collection is a lot of tissue Kanjiwarams. So if you're looking again for something heavy for the, this Diwali to wear that is blingy, bright and really glittery, but a traditional piece, then this is a perfect option, what you're looking at here. 
and then here we have again a lot of kanji varans and a lot of bright colors again too many colors too many options really pretty patterns but from these i'm going to pick up something that's really beautiful so this one is like a peach pink color kanji varam so you can see this has a lot of traditional motifs in it which are uh, paisley style motifs there's a lot of detailing again this one has like a very big border intricate border a lot of paisley detailing towards the edge and on top we have this minimal kaddi border so if you want to convert a sari into a lehenga or if you want to just drape it in a different format which looks like a lehenga then this is a perfect option then moving on we again have a lot of kanji varams so these one are like soft kanji varams really smooth and these have minimal detailings on it and here i am picking up this lovely color which is like a bottle green so this one has very simple pattern so let's just open it uh, so as you can see it has a lot of stripes detailing in it and there's also this traditional style rich motif and you can see it has a lot of intricate pattern in it so this one is like a double shade green so it's really shiny and uh, towards the top and bottom there are no borders so if you like a borderless collection then it's really pretty and uh, this saree we have given you like a contrast blouse in pink color so let's just look at the blouse and pallu so this is a pallu for this saree which is really rich it has a lot of detailing on it and with that we have this lovely double shade pink blouse so moving on we again have a lot of kanji varams collection lot of colors covered in it there are a lot of pastels lot of brides and then we have something like a silver uh, zari gold zari and we also have both the zaris too in a single sari then moving on we have this lovely banarsi collection so here one of my favorite is this tissue banarsi sari so this one you can see has a lot of detailing on it it's a pastel tissue peach color so very lovely sari very lightweight and very soft and on the body you can see there are a lot of zari detailings in it with gold and silver and then there's also peach pink so if you want something lightweight in banarsi then this is a perfect option again from this lot there is one of my favorite color which is more like a maroonish wine so this one is on a nice beautiful stripes detailing so this is more like a gaji silk which is like a soft silk banarsi so on the body you have stripes a lot of meenakari and towards the edges you have this lovely border detailing which is again with gold and pink then moving on we have a lot of banarsis here i'm really confused as to pick up what because these are all like lovely patterns a lot of intricate floral designs a lot of animal motifs and everything is beautifully woven and very heavy but out of these i'm taking out something that's very contemporary and uh, one of my favorite color which is like a peach color so this one has a minimal floral detailing in the body so you have this bunch of flowers which is in a dull gold zari and again a soft silk banarsi towards the top and bottom you have minimal borders so this is like a single shade sari in peach color then moving on again here we have a lot of banarsi sarees but out of this i'm going to pick up something that's very contemporary chic and stylish and will really stand out for your diwali which is like a red color banarsi sari so this one has a complete stripes detailing in it so you can see the body has this minimal stripes detailing and towards the edge you have like a simple border on the top whereas the bottom is very interesting uh, which has complete flowers detailing and birds detailing and also it has a lot of meenakari detailing so you can see the birds are really standing out so you can probably go for like a contrast blouse for this one if you ask me and then again towards the back we have a lot of banarsi collection in this section we are going to cover a lot of gadwals when categories and all of that uh, so here we have a lot of gadwals behind me and as you can see they are in different colors and everything is like bright we also have pastels with bright borders so here i'm taking out something that's really unique which is like a double shade sari so this one is a double shade green with blue 
and uh, in the body you can see it has a double shade and also it has a lot of zari detailing with gold and silver and the motifs are very minimal and the borders you can see are the traditional style borders and they are on grey base so the top border has this minimal detailing with peacocks and kadi detailing and towards the edge in the bottom we have this paisley detailing with peacock motifs and in the pallu also it's a grey base pallu and also in the pallu it's completely woven so behind me you can see these uh, banarsis which are like a soft silk banarsi and simple banarsi sarees so i'm picking out this one which is more like a rose pink saree so this one is also a double shade with pink and white and you can see it has this minimal flower detailing in the body whereas the edge it has this beautiful detailing with big flowers and simple border so this is also like a soft silk banarsi saree and uh, moving on to the next collection we have a lot of venkatagiri sarees so you can see they are completely with silver zari and there are actually a lot of bright colors uh, so but i'm picking out something that's very contemporary which is like a lavender color so this one in the body has a uh, checks pattern and on the checks you can see there are a lot of traditional motifs uh, it has horse peacock and different sort of traditional motifs in it and towards the top and bottom we have a beautiful neon pink color which is standing out and with the lavender it's really pretty and on the top we have this detailing in flowers with zari and towards the bottom we have traditional intricate border which has a lot of horses flowers and rudraksha motifs and moving on we have a lot of soft silks and also we have a bandanis so first let's look at a soft silk so this one again the color is beautiful very rich so it's a blue color it's a midnight blue silk so this one you can see it has like a unique style motif on it and this sari is more like an antique sari and with this we have paired up this contrast border which is like a maroon color border and on that there's a lot of zari detailing and the pallu for this sari is also a maroon color pallu and on the pallu you can see there's heavy weaving and then now here let's take out this one so for diwali if you're looking for something for the puja for the lakshmi puja then you can probably go for like a traditional color which is like a haldi yellow so this one is like a proper bandhani which is like a hand craft and on top and bottom we have this pythni style banarsi borders so it has a lot of traditional lotus pattern in it on a brown base and then here we have a lot of soft silks and prints here i'm taking out this one which is a traditional piece and which also caught my eye because it's an off white so this one also for a puja is a perfect option and you can see in the body we have this traditional style lotus motifs towards the top and bottom for this saree we've given you an ikat border and here you can see a lot of detailing of cows and a lot of other detailing then moving on we have banarsi georgets really lightweight sarees and these are all like falling georget sarees so this one in particular is very pretty it has minimal motifs in it throughout you can see it's a simple texture saree with a lot of gold zari detailing and towards the edge you can see it has a zari detailing on it which is very simple and the color is very fresh then moving on i think this is going to be your favorite uh, stock that i'm showing you right now because for diwali we have a lot of clients asking for a lot of fancy sarees heavy embroidery sarees so behind me are a lot of organzas and a lot of tissue based organza sarees and these are are completely hand embroidered and a lot of them have a lot of machine work and thread work detailing too so here i'm picking out something that's my particular favorite so i'm just actually looking for a nice color because there are a lot of colors here uh, yet i chose to pick up this one which is like a light pink color so pink is everyone's favorite and it makes you really look fresh and it also gives like an edgy look to you so this one you can see in the body has complete floral pattern very minimal detailing very lightweight organza sarees for diwali if you want to run around here between a lot of kiosks then this one is a perfect option because it has simple work on it and uh, it has a lot of applique work detailing in contrast color which is a green and yellow 
then from these collections i want to show you also a bright sari like something that's i am wearing like you can see the piece that i'm wearing this is a complete zardozi sari so this one is on a soft silk and uh, it's on a purple base and this is a proper uh, zardozi style sari and you can see the zari throughout is in a lot of uh, copper color and also gold color and uh, coming to the blouse the blouse you can see here is something that is uh, paired up with this sari so we given a ready made blouse for this sari which is also a self color blouse and you can see the blouse is heavily embroidered so if you're a new bride or your bride going to be for diwali or if somebody wants to wear something heavy then this is a perfect option so on the same lines i'm showing you something in maroon color but this one doesn't have a zardozi but it has a complete pearl work so you can see it's so rich so soft so this one is on a satin base very soft and smooth so on the body you can see it has simple detailing on it and uh, towards the border as you can see it has complete detailing with a lot of flower motifs a lot of sequin work so coming to the blouse of this sari we've given you a plain blouse uh, whereas for the blouse border we've given you a complete detailing then moving on to we have a lot of uh, tassers uh, so here we have a lot of tasser printed sari tasser embroidered sarees and different collections mm. so out of which i am picking out this blue which is like a very rich color so you can see the color is beautiful and on top of it you can see this pita work so this pita work is also very latest kind of work so you can see it has simple flower motifs on it and throughout on that you can see there is a lot of border detailing too so if you're looking for a lightweight tasser sari which is going to be rich for any age group then this is a perfect option uh, so we're done with all the collections now but here you can see something that's on the mannequin which is very interesting so this one is on a tissue based silver tissue so you can see here the sari has this beautiful detailing and completely in dull gold so throughout the sari is completely embroidered and for this sari the blouse is also paired up with a complete embroidery so i hope you enjoyed this video today and i hope you enjoyed all the premium collections that we got to you today. today so if you want to get more details or if you want to see a proper image or a video or if you want to have a video call you can come in below or you can whatsapp on the numbers that we have given below a very happy diwali to you all thank you